that's kind of cool. It's like a... It's like a little PlayStation loading screen. And it's taking a while to load, just like a PlayStation game would. Actually, they didn't take this long to load. Oh, wait. Are we getting something here? Hey. Hey. Let me close that. Let me just, yeah, let me close that. Hello, everybody, and welcome. I was going to say welcome back, but this, we've never done this before. Listen to that music, bro. Welcome to Minecraft PlayStation Edition. I just realized something really crazy. I don't know why, but on OBS, it's Steve, but for me, it's like you're Brian. This is kind of, it's kind of creepy. No, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I had trouble getting this mod loaded up and I saw Hero Brian in the title screen when I was trying to fix the UI. I had a lot of UI issues trying to set this mod up, but I did not load into a game, so I don't even know what the game actually like looks like. I was told it looks like a PlayStation game from like back in the day, which I thought would be kind of cool, but I'm kind of assuming that there's more to this than it just looking like a PlayStation game. Um just because of what I saw in the UI and um, yeah unless that was just like a little easter egg but I, I think that there's probably more to this because I think that's actually like Hero Brian's mansion in the background I was also told to play this with a controller instead of like mouse and keyboard just because it would it, it'd fit better we got some options here there's like nothing here there's screenshots huh is like is this when I was messing with the settings <laughs> I didn't even know I accidentally took a screenshot of that but there's this which is the title screen maybe I took that as well but then there's this look at that it's like uh it kind of looks like netherite armor is this what the game actually looks like I did not take this picture um uh, can I go back angles to go back well why? I'm using an Xbox controller. So, let me explain to you guys what this is, what I know from this. Basically, this is like... Suppose... This, I mean, obviously, this did not happen. There was not a PlayStation 1 Minecraft game, which would be crazy. Minecraft, you know, would not work on the PlayStation 1 back in the day. But this is like PlayStation 1 style, I believe. Um, and whatnot. But basically, it's like a... It's supposed to basically be like a little demo or something. It's like, how do I explain it? It's like, I'm really having trouble. I'm, I'm sure most of you guys skipped. It's like leaked Minecraft. Like they found out that they're working on Minecraft for the PlayStation 1 back in the day. Now I can see like really early Minecraft maybe working for the PS2. But it'd have to be like a very, very small world. You know what I mean? And you could probably only have like one of them. Also... Did anybody else think that this was actually like a smile when you're younger? It's actually supposed to be a beard. Like these little two pixels here in the middle are actually his is like his mouth. And that's his nose up here. I used to think that that was a smile and I still like that's still what I see no matter how hard I try to look at it. But anyways, I'm yapping. I actually don't know what to expect from this. I don't know if it's going to be anything like Minecraft. There's a tutorial. Should we do that? That that sounds like something that'd be like in a creepypasta. Like, I loaded up the game and there's a tutorial. We got to check it out. Loading world for memory card slot one. Please do not remove memory card. Oh my god. That's kind of nostalgic. I don't know if you guys saw it because it's showing for me that you guys didn't see it. Also... The, the screen is supposed to like kind of look like a uh, old TV, I believe. So, yeah. Here we go. We're loading it up. My computer is sounding like a PlayStation 1 when you load up a game. There's a lot of mods in this, by the way. So, yeah. Oh, look at that. That's kind of cool. Also, we our FOV is really zoomed in. and I don't know how to feel about these graphics right now. I think... I think I gotta turn the FOV down a little bit. Well, I mean, you you get what I mean. I gotta I gotta put it to Quake Pro. Yeah. There we go. 
Okay, anyways, here we are. The controls are very, like... They feel very weird. Almost smooth. I didn't mean to screenshot. What is all this, then? Um... It's like a first person. That's like to look backwards quickly. That's kind of creepy, actually. Um, this is our inventory. Okay. Does punching the sheep like give wool instantly? No, we gotta kill that thing. We gotta kill that thing. Also, I just realized like the health bar and the hunger look different. Look at the raw mutton. It looks different. Is there no quick move? Oh, bro. If there's no quick move. Oh my god. Do I have to actually manually move everything so wait no b does it okay this i think i might have to turn the sense actually you know what i kind of like the sensitivity being slow like this it's really interesting also the movement is crazy i don't know how to explain it but there's like a lot of movement and i think this is the old minecraft tutorial world on the old like legacy edition But I don't know. But yeah. Let's, uh, let's chop down this tree. The oak log. I like how uh, everything like is floating. I don't know anything about this, by the way. Like I said. It's just crazy how like much movement there is to this. I don't know how far. like I don't know if this has like any recent stuff. In the game. Like all the copper stuff. All the copper. The deep mines and whatnot. This music sounds new. I kind of like this. It's actually really relaxing. It's not really that scary. It's a little laggy. But like besides that it's fine. The FOV is making me feel a little weird when I look down like that. I'm not going to lie. For me, it doesn't. I just realized like how far back it looks on OBS. OBS looks completely different, by the way. I don't know if we should play the tutorial world or not, because I feel like this is the actual like tutorial world, like from the Legacy Edition. That's what it was called before they discontinued it. I think it's a little nostalgic, but at the same time, it's not that nostalgic for me. If it was, like, the first, first, like, uh, tutorial world for, like, the 360, then I would be, like, really happy about that. But this, I don't know. This movement is crazy. I'm just pressing forward. Look at all this. It is a little nostalgic, though. I don't think I'm going to do this. I think we're going to start a new world if it'll let me. Unless this is what it is. Look what the cow looks like up there. Is that normal? I don't know what to expect from this. I'm actually kind of freaked out. Just a little bit. There's villagers. That doesn't, like, scare me at all. But there's villagers. They're just chilling in here, bro. Look at them. Can you trade with them? No, they're just... I'm sorry I'm like yapping and stuff. I just don't really know what to expect from this. And I'm trying to make commentary, but I don't know what to say. So... That kind of scared me. I think what we're going to do is we're going to leave this. And uh, saving world, do not remove memory card. We're just going to start up a new world, I think. If you guys want to play this mod for yourself, it should be in the description down below. Um, I, I think it's really interesting that, like, when you, like, load up a world, it shows, like, the, um, it, it, show, it says a thing, like, overworld disc, as if, like, you have to put in a disc for, like, each realm or whatever. So I didn't mean to do that. All right, we're going to name this... What should we name it, y'all? We're going to name it Carmzilla. Yeah.
We gotta go all the way over here. Or not? Okay. Should we put on hard? I do want to put on bonus chests. Default super flat, large biomes, amplified, solar biome. Let's just do default. Let's load this up. I don't know what this is all gonna have in store. I'm kind of. I'm sorry. I'm like going all over the place right now. All right, here we are. I mean, seem. Ow. Oh, it makes the old. Whoa. It spawned me in some sweet berry bushes. That's kind of messed up, man. Looks like we spawned in like a spursh biome. So obviously this isn't like too far away because we got jungles. We got the, the these biomes and whatnot. The uh. The spruce wood ones with the foxes. So obviously this isn't too far away from where we are now. But we're about to find out soon eventually. When we start going mining how far back this is. I think there's a whole channel where a guy like... It's like an ARG or something. For this entire like mod. And I haven't watched it, but I, I'm probably going to watch it like after I do this. This music is really cool. Now, why would they make Minecraft back in like, what did they say it was? I mean, the PlayStation 1 was like a little bit before I was born, I think. I was born in 2000. So I mostly played like the PS2. But I just don't think that this would even work on the PlayStation 1. That is 100% for sure. Like, I think a game could look like this. But being able to destroy blocks and stuff and, like, create stuff, I just think that that would, like, destroy it. You know? I keep feeling like I, this music is really like interesting too. It's like really nostalgic. Let's get some of these logs. Some of the birch wood. I think we should actually focus on survival because I think I did put it on hard. I don't know if this is just going to be like a normal let's play or not. Or if like weird stuff is actually going to happen. I feel like weird stuff is going to happen just because of the Herobrine thing I saw, unless that was just an easter egg. But I've been hearing about this, like, mod for a while. People say it's scary, so... I'm assuming... I just kind of hope it's not like the cave stuff or like the... Stuff runs at you full speed, you know, I, I forgot what it's called, but it's Some kind of like mod where they're like in the cave and They run at you there's bees which is cool. Also, I like that the item shows up on the left side there. Is this a Oh, that's actually really nice. It's sorting. I Actually really like the sorting. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. The sorting is really cool. I'm just like keeping my eye out because I'm paranoid that I'm gonna like see Cure Brian or something stalking me. We got some wall again. The wall of law. You know what I'm saying? I don't know where to, we should even build. But I definitely know I don't really want to be out at night. You gotta get the sheep. Come on now. Mr. Sheep. We do get XP, it looks like. We got some flowers. Should we make some dye from these peonies? It's pink dye. I didn't craft it, though. If I press B, I imagine it does. Boom. Wait, I get XP for crafting, too? Okay, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. There's some seeds over here I want to get. I like how stuff has like that little animation like isn't this kind of like how stuff used to look back in the day like the 
Whoops. Oh, I can do that whenever? That's kind of freaky. Yeah, I like how that looks. But it's huge looking. <laughs> this is on the floor like that. I'm really sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm like all over the place. I'm really fascinated by this. It's a little like... I hate to be that person, but I just don't think that this game would even work on a PlayStation 1. You know? I think it could work maybe on a PS2 with like a certain amount of distance you can go. But this game would definitely take up like a lot of data, like a memory card or something. It's like a cave down there. I think this actually does have the cave update. This might be like recent because like look at this. Wait, what is that? Is that copper? Should we build down here in this tunnel? This has got to be copper. Alright, baby. Crafting is so slow. Yeah, we do get XP from crafting. Oops. But why would they make Minecraft all these years ago and not release it, you know? Is it because something was off about the game that they didn't want people to see? What could it be? I didn't mean to do that. I just meant to get out of the menu. I forgot to grab that. Uh, oops. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. That is, that's got to be copper. I don't think we can get it with an, a wooden pickaxe. Let's get this coal. Is that a creeper over there? Pretty sure it is. I gotta turn my volume up because it's a little quiet for me. For you guys, it probably sounds like fine. Hopefully, it's not like too loud for you guys. I just don't want the sound to be picked up through the mic because I don't wear headphones. Diorite looks kind of cool, actually. Like in the inventory. Like it looks like static. The low quality texture. What are these noises I'm hearing? Maybe I should put headphones in. Wait. Oh, it's the echoes from like picking stuff up. I feel like I should put headphones in, huh? Oh, dang. I gotta make another stick. I'm so slow. This is going to waste all the time in the entire world. We're going to find out if this is copper or not. It looks like copper. It gives me like a lot at once. Oh yeah, that's raw copper. Raw copper sucks. I don't use copper. So I wonder, like, how different the gameplay is going to be. Like, if there's going to be, like, new or different feature features, or should I say cut features? We gotta go find that sheep. I, I saw the sheep, and I... My silly little brain just, like... Completely 
forgot that I actually need to make a bed to survive. Thought there was like eyes in that cave. That was kind of creepy. It was just like the other side or something. I might be crazy, but I feel like I keep seeing stuff on like the corner of my eyes. Oh, you can block just like the old days. Look at that. That's so cool. Alright. Well, it looks like we're not getting that sheep. So what we'll do instead is just quickly get down. So I don't want to die. And we're going to put our stuff in a chest or something. We should have enough to make a chest. We gotta be as quick as possible, though. Let's make a double chest. What type of silly person makes a, a one chest? Oh, the noises are so cool. Wait. Boom. That's sick. Oh, the echo is so creepy to me. Because we're like at a cave, I think. Light it up, up. Up, light it up, 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 light it up, 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 up on fire. I don't think torches look like this anymore. Did they ever look like this? Were they ever like 2D looking? I don't even know anymore. I should go back to playing like old Minecraft. What the hell is that? Oh, he's got, he's got armor on him. I thought that was like a, gl that was cool. But anyways, I'm alive. The, the noise it made and just the explosion and then the, oh, that just brought it all back to me. I thought that was some kind of visual glitch, but I think he's wearing enchanted armor. Anyways, let's go mining. Let's go gambling. So freaky. The slow sensitivity makes me feel like one of those, like, really annoying, like, people in the ARGs, the, like, the Minecraft ARGs, where they're, like, moving around so slow. Because they're, like, trying to build tension in the video. I swear I'm not trying to do that. It's just really low sensitivity. And look at these options. Do you see sensitivity? There's FOV, music and sounds. That's it. There ain't nothing else. Look at, yeah, I, I feel like torches never did this. Why are they floating? Is that a glitch? <laughs> I don't know. really spooky that is for sure there's so many things I could say right now that, and I just don't know what to say and I'm really sorry about that like my brain is all over the place playing this there's so many things that I could say right now oh look a cave I don't know why but I feel like I shouldn't go in here oh, that scared me <laughs> the, I've been scared by that before, actually. Something just does not feel right with me. 
I don't want to go down here. Like, I, I can't believe that I'm genuinely this freaked out, but, like, But I have to mine, like, there's, <laughs> there's, like, nothing I can do, bro. Listen to that, that is terrifying. That makes it so much scarier. Stop. Oh, he sees me. Are you ready for combat? I wonder if they take more damage when I jump attack like that. This is kind of peak Minecraft for some people because, like, they don't have the swiping effect. And it's like, it's just like, it has a lot of Java features. Like, this is probably peak Minecraft to some of you guys. I don't really want to travel into the unknown right now. What? I oh, you scared me, bro. Don't sneak up on me like that. What? I feel like something's going to run at me really fast. Like, I kind of feel safer going back upstairs. Like, being out here at night. Oh, it's raining, too. That's so perfect, bro. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. Oh, it's a bat. It's a bat with no hat. Hello? That was an Enderman. He's probably chilling out somewhere. Out of the rain. They can see me from so far. Do you see this? It's like they always know where I am. Oh my god. I don't know if I want to build a house down here in this like hilly area, but maybe it's kind of all I got right now. I do have some more coal. I can make a. We can make some more sticks, some more torches. Split those, get the sticks, put the sticks in the chest, get the coal, get the coal, get the sticks, alright, and then we're gonna make a furnace. I'm freaked out a little bit, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's kind of a cool feature, I didn't mean to make that much. I didn't mean to do that, but it's okay. Alright, I don't want to use the coal. I want to use the coal for, like, torches. We don't even have coal, so... What we'll do is we'll split this, like this. All I want is an iron sword to make me feel a little bit more safe. And then we'll head up and chop down some trees. Oh, this music is so cool, though. Makes feel it makes me feel like everything is gonna be okay. Not really. That's a lie. Mr. Bat, you kinda scared me like multiple times. Turning into day, I'm kind of hoping the rain will stop. I 
I don't like that noise. Statistics. Is there gonna be like some weird stuff? No. I keep thinking like some weird ARG stuff is gonna happen, but now I'm kind of wondering if like this is just like the it's just supposed to be like atmospheric, you know? I'm just kind of hoping that's what it is. It's kind of fun going into this blind because I don't know if like something is gonna spook me or something. Let's make an axe. We're gonna go chop down some trees. And we'll plant some as well, you know. We don't want to deforest everything here. I do want to get a sword before I go out, though. Maybe make an iron axe as well. We need sticks. There we go. We can probably smelt this wooden store the wooden sword. Huh? Where did it, where did it go? Oh, it's in my inventory. I'm so blind. Okay, we actually can smelt it. That's kind of nice. Uh, maybe we can make like a. No, nah, we're not gonna get enough. It's all right. We're no like serious danger. I don't believe. We're going to just chop down trees, just so we can get some charcoal. If something does show up and I miss it, you guys let me know. I'm going to leave a lot of this unedited, so it might be awkward at times. And I apologize, because I yap a lot. I mean, I feel like that's pretty normal for a YouTuber to do, right? I feel like that's kind of my job, actually. I'm glad it stopped raining. It's actually my job to be yapping. This is so peaceful up here now. Part of me wants to turn the render distance down. I'm pretty sure I can. Hold on. No, there was something down there, I swear. He's still down there, bro. Huh? Is that a zombie horse? Are these even in the game? Oh my god, bro, I'm sorry. I I saw the blue and I was like, is that just Hero Brian? <laughs> is he just chilling down here? If you say Hero Brian three times, he shows up. Hero Brian, Hero Brian, Hero Brian. That would have been actually hilarious if he did. I probably would have stopped playing though if he did show up because it like then I would assume that this game is like for real haunted. You know what would be kind of cool with this is if you put like the from the fog mod. I think there's a lot of stuff from that that I missed. I think I might play that some more. But having that with this mod would be really cool. Because he would just be stalking you. Also, I did notice something. I, I saw, like, some pictures. I can't even remember them. I'll have to, like, look at them again. It's It was, like, in the game files. I think there was, like, one of, like, Herobrine or something. I have to say, this movement is really nice. But I think that one of them was of Herobrine. And I remember when I was messing with, like, the UI and stuff. Herobrine showed up. And, uh, oh yeah, and when I started this video, I'm pretty sure that he was on the title screen as well. I just realized I need to be looking at the left at my hunger and health. 
I'm not really invincible here. <laughs> I'm just kind of wandering around, almost hoping for something to happen. But maybe it's for like the best. I need to actually focus on my goal. Just to survive, baby. You know? I feel like since it's like PlayStation 1 graphics, we gotta make like a house that's like... Dead. We gotta make like an old school looking house or something. I like how the saplings to the spruce trees look. Very cool. Very nice. I must say. What a beautiful sight. Alright, bro. You gotta get out of here. You gotta get out of here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put one in there. Whoops. I'm so stupid. That should be good. Let's plant some berries around just for food and protection. Really? Does these do damage? There's some iron here I'm going to get. I'll just have like a line of berries. <laughs> My berry def bush defense does some damage to whatever may be lurking. Is that? Oh, uh, wait. Is that deep slate? It's andesite. I thought it was cobblestone almost. Should we just play in like third person? That was a that was a leaf, right? That was that's definitely a leaf. I'm just being paranoid, man. I'm sorry. There's like a, a lot of videos on this mod that I kind of want to watch. Because I think that this might be based off of like an ARG. And they made like a mod based off of the ARG. It's just... Oh no! It's gone. Yeah, no, I heard that. Alright, now I'm actually starting to feel uncomfortable. There's like no music, there's no action, there's just nothing. It almost feels like someone's trying to sell me something. Oh, that scared me, bro. It's so quiet. I don't like it, man. The, the silence is deafening. We should, like, make a house or something over here. I was kind of thinking of it, right, like, doing something right here because it's kind of a cool spot. Like, it's in the cave, you know? But we can also build up here. Like... Maybe have, like, some kind of cool, like, steps that go up into the forest. I think a village would be really nice. I think that'd make me feel, like, less uncomfortable. We do need to focus on finding a sheep as well, because I... I got a feeling that there's going to be phantoms in this game as well. And I... I don't know. What if they're, like, scary? You know what I mean? Like, what if they're scary-looking phantoms? What if they got, like, faces... I'm gonna fly in at you. That'd be really scary. I doubt it though. But if I was right, like what if I was exactly right? I really want to find a sheep. That's kind of why I'm adventuring out a little bit. And also like seeing if there's any like features to all this. There's some water over here.
The water looks really cool. It's really cool to me. Oh, hey, I needed you. Sorry. But it's either you or me. There's some mushrooms here. I don't know if they naturally grow. Well, yeah, they, they gotta grow in like forests like this, right? I thought this was gonna be like a big old ravine. Ravine! Let's hurry back to the house. I don't really want to be out here like late at night. If I ain't gotta... Let's, let's hurry. I feel like me running is making it scarier. She just calm. I, I need to calm down. You could be watching. I feel like there's something there, man. I really swear that I, I feel like I keep seeing stuff. I'm just being paranoid, man. I'm just being paranoid. There ain't nothing here, man. I need to calm down. I need to calm myself down. There ain't nothing here, son. There ain't nothing here. Your Brian doesn't exist. I want a pink bed, bro. I want a pink bed. I got pink dye. Why not? You know, who would make just a boring old white bed? Let's make a cool, cute little pink bed. I love pink. Pink is my favorite color. Yes, queen. Hold on. Beds? You better tell me that there's a bed in this game. <laughs> you better tell me that there is a bed in this game. Did I make it? I think I made it. Okay, let's just sleep. Let's just sleep. I don't like that. Oh, I did not like that. That it actually went dark. That makes it scarier. I got a feeling that there's more to this. I don't know. But I just got it. I just got a sneaky little feeling. Let's get that. I really like that crafting. Like, upgrades your XP. That That's not actually a thing, is it? I don't think it is. Alright, we'll start with like a simple little cave house. I'm not good at building, by the way. I think a lot of you probably understand that. You guys are going to see how bad I am at building, actually. So, what I want to do is actually chop down some more trees. I've been playing like I'm still kind of new to like modded Minecraft, by the way. This is the s third mod actually that I've played. Because most of my life I've played Bedrock. And uh, I only recently, like, I think like two years ago, started getting into Java Edition, which is just so much better, in my opinion. Just because it's like less buggy and glitchy. I wish Bedrock was a little, like, better. I like both versions in their own way, but. Like, I like Bedrock for multiplayer a lot more. Like, if you just want to do, like, a quick survival game with your friend or something, then I think Bedrock's the way to go, but... You know. It's still a little glitchy in a lot of different ways, you know? And... It's, it's, it's a little weird sometimes when you play online if you have not the best internet on Bedrock. That's... That cave keeps freaking me out. <laughs> I bet these caves are like connected or something. A part of me wants to turn on the normal options and put off the sensitivity because I can do that. I had to learn how to do all kinds of stuff fixing this UI. But maybe I should just like leave it, you know? It kind of makes things a little more eerie. Like, I, I gotta turn it around so slow. And it's just, I don't know. There could be anything behind me. But I can also do this! We just 
turn around very fast at any moment. Hiya! Sorry if that made anybody dizzy. I'm just being a little silly. I'm hearing noises from outside that I keep thinking are like, is like weird ambience from the game. You can only sleep at night. Or during thunderstorm. I want to see something. But if there's more screenshots. 1998 apparently. This is, was when this came out. I think all these other screenshots are ones that I took on accident. <laughs> I'm <laughs> trying to set up the game. Obviously, I took that one, right? Now I'm a little freaked out because I don't remember taking this one. I remember there being three. Did I take this by accident? Yeah. I need to not worry. Okay, pausing the game actually does pause it. That's kind of nice. I just want to make this iron... I do want to make like some kind of stone brick design. Oops. I keep pressing B because I keep thinking it's going to make me go back. I don't actually remember what the actual controls were for this game. Like on the Xbox, so maybe I'm trying to like play with old school Xbox controls. We'll have like a cool spruce door here. I think the spruce wood will look kind of nice for the front of here. I do want to have like a little bit of cobblestone. I kind of want it to feel like somewhat like a, like a mine almost. Like a little house. Like a, that was originally like a mine maybe. Like that, that's kind of cool. Then we can place like two torches like, hello? What was that? Huh? Y'all, I don't know what that was, but that was a little weird. I'm pressing like all the buttons on the controller and I don't know what did that. That was That was really weird. I don't have enough. I just want to make another furnace to speed up some processes. Here we go. I didn't mean to make that many. I'm an idiot. That's okay. <laughs> we'll never need another one ever again. What I want to do is get the stone and then put it in here like that. And we can split that, put that in here. Make some smooth stone design. I didn't mean to make that many, bro. Why did the game pause like that? That still kind of scared me. I'm not going to lie to you. I, I I don't know if there's anything else to this game, guys. I really don't. I keep expecting something to happen, but I, I'm, I'm starting to think. I'm just not going to worry about it anymore. It's probably really annoying. I did not mean to make that many. Oh well, it's fine. We're gonna get some more while we build this. We built this city. 
We built this city on rock and roll. <laughs> I don't know why the game paused like that, though. I think that might have just been me pa 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 shibui. I don't want it to be claustrophobic in here, so we're gonna. The torch scared the hell out of me, bro. I thought that was something else. I just saw that like little movement there, and I thought there's something walking outside. I'm so paranoid, guys. I am so sorry. I think this is just based off of an ARG. I don't think there's much else to it. Which is fine. It's still really cool. Unless there's like stuff happening and I'm just really oblivious to. But it's been 50 minutes now. Let's do that. That's so cool that you level up from that. And then let's... Make some doors. Oh, it opens both at the same time. That's kind of cool. That's something we need. We can make like an iron pickaxe, I suppose. Because I think we kind of need a little bit of cobblestone. Actually, we'll make both. We'll make a cobblestone. And uh, I own. Boom. It's starting to get dark again already. Where is the sun? I don't want it to be dark in here. I don't want my home to feel too spooky. I want it to feel like a little spooky and kind of match like the the game, but I don't want it to be like I don't want it to be like I don't want to go home spooky. I'm getting my bed. I'm getting my bed and I'm going inside and I'm gonna go to sleep, man. <laughs> I'm too scared to sleep. Huh? What do you mean, bro? Nah. Does it just say that because it was like still daytime? I want to get some sand as well and put it in the front there. Does it say that all the time? No! What? Okay, it only said it then, bro. That's... No, that's weird. That That's a weird mechanic. I don't know what that is. Do I get too scared or something? Like, what does that mean, bro? I'm overthinking. 
No, that's gotta mean something though, right? I'm too scared to sleep. It doesn't say that all the time when I'm not allowed to sleep. Is that just like a one-time thing? Just to freak me out, I don't know. Everything seems pretty chill. You know, also I do want to get some glass. I think that, uh, it'll look kind of nice. For this little cave home. I want to put like some cobblestone maybe on the sides. Or just some like smooth stone. That'd actually be kind of cool. I think we got plenty. We got some stone. Oh my gosh, shame. Smooth stone. We'll put on the sides here. Huh. Hello. I was not expecting that. He has green eyes. Seems like he's, like, mad at me, though. Is that a... I mean... He's got green eyes, but like, is he trying to hit me already? I didn't even look at him. Does it matter? I remember Enderman used to have green eyes. They also used to drop, uh, rotten flesh back in the day. But I don't know if they just attacked you like no matter what you did part of me wants to test to see if he was just gonna like run at me I don't know if we should have a bedroom or not because I feel like that would be scarier than it just being all open maybe it actually would be better too I don't really need it now I'm just setting spawn if it'll even if that's even a thing Let's go down there and fight that thing. I'm ready, bro. Come on now. Come on, son. Come on, cuz. Oh, that's like a bedrock feature. Oh, God. I'm like down. I'm down here now. Just build a staircase. He ran off, bro. He ran off. No, uh, uh Yeah, there's definitely different gameplay features because I, I was looking directly at him and I think that he's just going to attack me instantly. Also, remember in the tutorial how the cows looked? I don't know if I haven't seen a cow here or not. That is so scary. That was him. This is so scary, guys. I'm, I'm so freaked out, man. <laughs> Like the echoing, that just makes it so scary, bro. He's here, he's here, he's here. Hello, hello. Is he gonna attack me? He. He's tough, he's tough. He's tough. But I'm tougher. I think I need some food. Let's get out of here. I'm guessing this, like, cave system probably, like, reaches the other.
I just heard like a sheep. Oh, there he is. It's a ghost sheep. We gotta keep eating until we're like full health. Make a few more torches. Let's just do this, yeah. That makes it better. I don't care what anybody says. That's just a lot more convenient for me. I don't know if I want this like hole right here next to my house. What I do want some sand so I can make some glass. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna go on a little adventure. I don't think the water is far from here though. Actually, this is kind of cool looking from up here. I like how our little home looks. No, I think that was just a normal Enderman. The only thing I'm noticing that's a little different is the uh, too scared to sleep. That's a little weird. I don't know what that was about. Found to found just find some sand. I think I already did actually. I should have grabbed some dirt because I don't like leaving like holes all over the place. It bugs me. I think it's silly. It's stupid. I hate how it looks. I don't have a shovel, so we're just doing it as bare hand, baby. Yeah, baby. We don't need like too many. If we do this, will it like fix itself? There we go. What was that? Oh, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like wet or something. Don't just stop, bro. It's not. That's not that funny. Don't don't even make the joke. I know what you're gonna do. Just don't even make the joke. It's a little bunny rabbit. I'm gonna kill you! That was a scary noise. Just from throwing the eggs. He tossed the hell out of them. Bro, did not give a damn. He said, nah, uh. -uh. These floating books. Nah, this is weird. I didn't do this. That's like a hero brine thing. There's no way this, like, naturally spawned, bro. Look at that. Look at the way that the... Okay. I'm pretty sure Herobrine does something like this. <laughs> I don't know if this is just a very crazy coincidence, but, like... I feel like that's, like... Supposed to be, like, man-made. You know what I mean? And I did not do that. The echoing of the cave makes things a lot scarier. Kind of makes me not want to live here. But we ain't got no choice. Ooh. Yeah, there's something. If this was like, if this was like the From the Fog mod, I think that I would have seen him already. You know? Uh, you know what? We should actually worry about survival and put some like logs in there first. See, now it's not saying it. Uh, 
Let me sleep. Good morning, USA. I know it's gonna be a good morning. The sun, the sky, the smile, the face. Oh, and you saying good morning, USA. Wait. Oh, it's like a crafting table for the freaking furnace. Wait, what? I see. That's kind of cool. I wasn't done smelting, though. I'll see what they're trying to do. I'll see ya. We're gonna put some glass here. I think we're gonna cover that hole up for now. Because I don't really want that there. I don't like it there. I just don't want anything about that hole being close to where I live. So we are gonna cover up this demonic hole. The demon hole. Of demonic things. Hold up. Let's close that. We don't really need that. And now we can put it in. We're going to have like a little glass pane design or something. The music is really similar to like C418 songs, but it's pretty different. I like it actually. It's like really relaxing. Should we go back into the cave and stop being a wimp? I kind of want to make iron armor. That's how scared I am. I, I gotta make iron armor. Let's just wait. Because we got some in here. We can make a full set. Nuggets. I don't want to make a nugget. We gotta open it up. No, let, nah. darn it. Okay, whatever. We'll do this. We'll do like a little cute design like this. Boom, boom, and then boom. Yes. We could have it to the floor too, but I feel like that's kind of ugly. So what we'll do is we'll uh, get like some wood. I think the spruce wood like works really well for this type of design here. These sheep are gonna annoy me, bro. I really like the sheep. Like I really like the sheep. What man? I sound so stupid right now. No, what I was gonna say is I really like the echoing. That's such a cool feature, and I kind of wish that was just a normal, like, Minecraft, almost. But I feel like that would, like, be kind of glitchy somewhat if they were to do that. Alright. We are out of wood. I feel like that's something we gotta do. Planted some like trees a little bit closer to where I want to build, but I'm not. I don't know. I think a baby zombie would actually destroy me with this low ass sensitivity. Like, I'm so screwed. <laughs> the baby zombie starts running at me. There's nothing I can do. You know what I did? Just kind of realize that there is like some gameplay features that are different. Like the block placing and not only that, but the combat. So I don't think this is just like a texture pack or like a retexture of things. I think that there is like something 
different about this and i just i don't know what yet i don't know if there's anything like specifically horror or i don't know if it's just supposed to be atmosphere yet if it's just supposed to be atmosphere only this is actually kind of cool i like this i like this little design it feels like a little mine house Voila! I don't know if there's like new enemies either. I mean, obviously the zombie horse, like, I don't think that's in Minecraft still. I think that's just like a, I think it's something you can spawn, but I don't think it's like. I don't know. Let's chop down a few more trees. I just don't think the zombie... Unless it's like incredibly rare. Because I've never seen a zombie horse in Minecraft. And I remember back in the day people saying like, Oh yeah, you can't get zombie horses. Let's just get the normal logs. Remember what I was saying? Like just a second ago, if I don't know if this is like normal. Bro, why did he move like that? That was like normal player movement. That is so scary. You guys saw that, right? Go back. You can literally just see him watching me and he walks off. Like, I was literally just saying, like, I don't know if this is just atmosphere or not, but that just like proved my point that this is like I'm being watched. And that we're like an hour in, an hour and 12 minutes in, and he just shows up and it's just like, hey, he walks off. All right, bro. I don't know why it didn't scare me too much. Because I think it's because I was expecting it so much. Like, I was expecting it to be, like, from the fog almost. Oh, that's creepy, though. Is that all it is, though? Or is there more to this? See, that's what I don't know. He definitely acted different from from the fog. Because that's like a separate mod on its own. Unless this is just like a pack. I'm stupid. But yeah, yeah, he's watching me for sure. I've been asking this like for a whole hour. Like, is he is, is something gonna happen? Like an idiot, and something just happened. And I'm not even that scared by it. It didn't scare me too badly, but it was kind of cool. The way he walked like a normal player was a little freaky though. Like if I saw that in normal Minecraft, I would go poo poo and pee pee everywhere, bro. Like if I was playing Minecraft as a kid, yeah. I'm guessing the ARG is like kind of a, I, I hate to say this, but I think it's like kind of a basic like ARG where it's like, Like, you're not supposed to own this version of the game. Creepy stuff happens. But there could be more to it. Well, this is kind of the vibe I'm getting. But there was a, you're too scared to sleep. Thing as well. That makes me wonder if there's like more to this. You know? I want to put a torch up here just to make it feel better. I actually don't know if it makes it feel better or more scary. We got some logs we can just put away. Put away, put away, put away, put away now. Alright. I do want to make some more uh, torches. We're going to use this to turn it into sticks. We're going to make some torches. Does your Brian like hurt you or anything? Because I, I think in From the Fog, he doesn't. But in this one, he might. What is that? It's a smithing table, and it looks cool. I got my big boy pants on here, O'Brien. You can't do nothing. 
what's scary is that he he took so long to show up too. I didn't have boots, did I? I don't think there is boots in here. I I don't know why I thought I made boots. Boom. I got my full set of armor, baby. I like the little armor rating. It's like old school, actually. It's kind of cool. Now I'm going to be looking out for him. I already was kind of like looking out for him, but now I'm really going to be looking out for him. Because I don't know what he does. Oh yeah, I got distracted. I was going to make some sticks. I'm so stupid. Yeah, there we go. Actually, that's kind of what we wanted. Glad I didn't make a bunch of doors on accident. <laughs> I would have never forgiven myself if I made a bunch of doors. I did make a bunch of furnaces, but that's a little more forgivable. Than making a bajillion million doors. Let's go to bed, bro, before something weird happens. You know, I don't know if having the glass there makes me feel better or not. Having the door open oddly makes me feel better, though. Alright, let's go down in the mine. I, although, I'm like, I am actually stalling, I feel like. Because I don't want to go down there. We should make a shovel, though, first. See, guys, I am stalling. I mined, like, for a little bit once, and that was it. Because I was so scared. The atmosphere is terrifying. I really wish that there's more horror games that, like, understood atmosphere. Because I feel like that's just so important. In so many games, they just don't do that no more. They just... It's just all about blood and gore now. Hello. Why did it feel like you just kind of came out of nowhere? Why are you so tough? Because I'm on hard difficulty? Can they see me further now that they're now that I'm like on hard difficulty? Hold on, bro. I'm trying to place down a torch just because I know these skeletons are gonna mess me up. That scared me. I like that they make the old noises. Oh my god, I saw the old glitch. For a second. The old blocking while hitting glitch. It's iconic. Do you think he shows up more on Peaceful? You know, like you're Ryan. While I'm mining, I don't really need that up. I feel like having bears with you while you're mining is actually really smart, because if you get lost, you just live off of those things. I'm really just trying to, like, be cheerful and, like, whatnot. There's a gold, but I don't really care. I'm just trying to be, like, cheerful, because this is actually really terrifying for me. What if he's, like, right behind me? He did that to me before, when I did the From the Fog mod, but... I'm gonna guess that he shows up, like, a lot less. I do like the swiping effect. I kind of do miss that a little bit. If there's something that happened that I missed, like, let me know. Because I'm stupid and I'll probably, like, not hear something or not see something. Because my volume is a little low. But if you guys see something, let me know, bro. That'd be so cool. I 
Why does it sound like someone's mining with me? Don't do that, man. That ain't funny. Oddly enough, being in water made me able to see more. I have a light behind me I don't want to turn off, by the way. And, um... It's making it a little bit harder to see the game. I really like how this looks on OBS. Like, I really like that it looks like an old, like, you're playing, like, on an old TV. It's kind of cool. It doesn't look like that too much for me, but on OBS, it looks like that. You guys got, like, a cooler looking atmosphere than I do. You guys should be proud. I, I don't know why I said proud. You guys should be happy. I should have wrote down the coordinates to my house. Silly old me. I'm so stupid, bro. You know what would be even scarier is if, like... There actually isn't, like, here, Brian, in this, in this mod, and I, like... Somehow, like, brought the From the Fog mod over to this one. Oh! I was like, what is that thing moving in the dark? But that's a warden. That's a whole other thing on its own, but, like, I think we're good. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I haven't really encountered too many wardens. I don't know fully how they work. Which is just terrifying on its own. I know if, like... The screecher goes off, like, I think three times. It could be different on hard. I just realized that I'm playing on hard. Um, that could, like, mess things up. What are, what are these? Is that like deep slate? It's cobbled deep slate. I like how deep slate looks. I don't want to go down there, bro. Wait, he was there? That's fucked up. I didn't even hear him or, like, see him. He just, like, came up behind me. I didn't hear him at all. Did you guys hear him? I feel like I would have heard him. I gotta get my stuff, though, bro. I'll, I'll get my stuff and leave, Mr. Warden. You don't gotta, like... Do nothing. I kind of want to hear that game over music. Is he going to be really scary? I'm overthinking. I didn't hear the screecher at all. Bro. I haven't even really had like a good look at him before he's not here I'm taking my stuff and leaving. Goodbye. You fucker. Experience kinetic energy. The fuck is kinetic energy, bro? That scared me, though. What 
is kinetic energy? Are you telling me that the stuff that's like flying through the air right now is what's killing me? Because I know he has like a sonic boom thing that just goes through walls. I'm like, don't tell me that that, the little sound wave things is like, what's just completely destroying me. Just let me out of here, bro. What is kinetic energy? <laughs> Just let me leave, bro. Just let me leave. Please, I need this. <laughs> bro, I'm actually scared. I don't even know how I'm dying. Look at how cute that little bat is up there. Look at I'm not even really scared, like, it, it jump scares me, but I'm not like, I'm just annoyed now. Oh, don't, you don't wanna, you don't wanna find me. If you know what's good for you, you won't come over here. Alright, just grab my stuff and go. Goodbye. I don't know what the hell kinetic energy is, bro. I got all my stuff. I don't care no more. I don't care anymore. You see, I don't care no more. Yeah, play that peaceful music, bro. I need that right now. He is still following me. You gotta, you gotta see that? You gotta see this below me. I feel like zombies do kind of need like some kind of buff on hard. Because they... They, they still suck. That was really weird. And break instantly. There's like a bedrock glitch. <laughs> mm. I remember back in the day... One of the things that really, like, I thought was cool, Minecraft made me realize, like, so much stuff is possible, is I was mining in this one area for so long, and, uh, it was kind of back when water was a little bit darker, kind of looked like that. Look at the lava, they got the old school lava textures, that's so cool. Um... I, I was like, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm struggling to tell this story right now. No, what, one thing that made me realize how cool Minecraft was is uh, I was in this cave for like a long time. I was always mining in it. And I came across this like waterfall that I would like use it like bring me back up to the surface. And one day I took the waterfall. Oh, shit. I was just thinking, like, what's that noise I hear? Scared me. I, one day, I, I was going up this, like, waterfall, and I come across, like, this really small opening, and I went through this opening. And I found this massive cave system. And it was the coolest thing to me. What was that? Was that here, Brian, or was that a zombie? Bro, if there's no zombie here, I'm gonna assume that was here, Brian. That was here, Brian. All right, I see how this is. The way that everything. Oh, look at the spiders! Oh my God, they crawl on walls. 
Okay, this is cool. I kind of wish that they did that. They need something, bro. Because they suck. They suck on, like, Bedrock Edition. They suck on Java. They just... They die. That's all they do. Can't leave this tree floating. The spiders look really cool, though. They definitely need something like that, man. Because, like... They suck. <laughs> There's just no other way of putting it. They need something like that in like vanilla Minecraft because they really suck. I don't know where I am. That's okay. Is there other stuff at night that's going to like freak me out? What was that? If you guys go back, you can like see that for yourself. It was like in between the trees over here. Should I even be going towards whatever that was? I just saw like a glowing freaky thing. What's that, bro? I mean to do that. I, I need that sword, bro. I meant to go into third person. Oh, bro, he took my sword. He took it. Hiya! What were my coordinates? What were my coordinates? Should I just sleep? So I wasn't too scared to sleep. I don't know the general like location of where that was. There's a trader, watering wandering trader, which is kind of cool. He's running. Oh my god, bro! I think my stuff is. I think that. I think he has my stuff. <laughs> Uh-huh. He does. Bro, I want my stuff back. He took my sword. I was trying to figure out what I was looking at. Bro, I'm gonna push you out over here. That's gotta be my stuff, bro. That's gotta be it. Let's look at it. Yeah, that's... That's part of it. Hey there, man. You gonna try to sell me my own stuff that I just lost? Because that would be kind of scummy. He just said, mm-hmm. Hold on, bro. Your alpaca actually jump scared me. Why do they move so like fast? Okay. Banners. Boring. It's cool to see another face around here. All right, my stuff has got to be close because I think that was my stuff that that zombie had. But there's also a rare chance that it isn't. No, this is it. Bro has full gold armor. My stuff got blown all over because the creeper like blew me up. Zombies got full gold armor. There it is. Don't blow my stuff up, please. Alright, whatever. Here's my stuff. Yeah, they all just took a pick into my stuff, man. That was cool, though. I actually am really enjoying this. I kind of wish that vanilla Minecraft had a bunch of this stuff, man. It's so cool. I gotta repair some of the earth, man. It's my fault. It's my fault it got this way anyways. What kind of person would I be if I didn't try to repair the earth? Why do I feel like Herobrine watches you, like, more often when you build? Like, I feel like he might do that, like, purposely on, uh, from the fog. But I just, I have a feeling that he might do that for this, too. Anyways, we got everything back for the most part. Yeah, bro, I went flying up in the sky and I hit that zombie at least before I died. That thing's semi-flying. I don't even think they can do that in vanilla. What was that thing glowing, though? Was that just like an enchanted zombie or something? Because that was really bizarre looking. 
An enchanted zombie with golden armor, maybe? The one that I just fought, like, a second ago? I don't know. But I will tell you this. This mod is very cozy and I like it. Despite it being terrifying too. Bro, I know you ain't got nothing for me. But I ain't gonna kill you either. Huh? He's like, what do you mean? You would give me a blue... I like how it's called Blue Rose. They were never called that before. Wow. Wally. Yeah, bro. I think you're funny. Well, let me tell you something. Where I live, stuff like that ain't funny. What am I talking about? I'm, <laughs> I'm going crazy. I think I should just, like, go to bed. It's late for me. It's 3 a.m. It's 3.27 a.m. at night, bro. I think uh, I think I should just, like, go to bed. This is very fun, though. And I feel like there's going to be more than just Hero Brian. I really hope it is more than just Hero Brian because this is, like... This has so much potential to be more than just Hero Brian. Although, Hero Brian is scary. You know, as a kid, I, I, I think what makes this really scary for me, at least, is that, like... It my it's very nostalgic, and I remember being a kid and being scared of Hero Brian at times. I w I wouldn't say like all the time, but there's times where I was like, "What if I just saw him right now?" And that's how I felt during this whole thing. That was really weird. What was that noise I just heard? And when I actually saw him, it was a little shocking. I wouldn't say it was, like, jump scare-like, but it was shocking. Like, I felt my heart just, like, oh, my God, that was scary. And he was up there. My heart just dropped. What am I hearing? Bro, I think I'm hearing stuff in real life or something. Oh, I didn't realize it's going to be like that. I think I'm going to play more of this before I watch any videos on this. Don't do that. You guys heard that. That was not me, bro. It sounded like something was running at me full freaking sprint. It's because I'm looking around. It, the game knows how paranoid I am right now. I'm really paranoid. I don't know if I want to play this on, like, <laughs> on controller again, though, to be honest. It is very, like, it, it makes it, like, more immersive, but I like my faster movements a little bit more. I don't think it'll, like, scare me any more or less. If I'm able to, like, look around faster. I'll keep the sensitivity the same. I, 
keep hearing these noises. I don't know what that is. It must be like down here. The zombies or something. But anyways. I think I'm actually going to end this video here. I'm sorry I was all over the place. Saving world. Do not remove memory card. I love that it says that. And there's Steve. He's just chilling, bro. Before we do that. Before we end this. Let's see if there's anything in here. Bro, I, I don't. Oh, wait, no, I actually do remember taking that. I took that by accident. This picture was took in 1998, bro. Look at this. Is that like a golden apple on the right side? Is that what that's supposed to be? That's kind of cool. Anyways. I think I'm going to end this one here. I really appreciate all the sports you guys guys have given is it me or is his eyes turning more white as time goes on i'm just like looking directly into his eyes and it looks like they're changing very slowly i don't like it it's, he's just he's just there bro i think if i leave this open long enough his eyes will just like turn white it just feels like he's peeking into my soul right now It was Jack Black. I feel like something's gonna happen if I just leave this up. It really does look like his eyes are turning more white, but I'm probably just crazy. They look like they're changing. I don't like being on this title screen for very long. I'm going to be honest with you. It's very eerie. Ooh. 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 You guys can't see, but I'm trying to click on him. I'm trying to click on Steve. All right, I, I quit the game. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to end this one here. We almost recorded this for like two hours. Um, I don't know if I'm going to record this or again, or if I'm just going to stream it, but I definitely do want to play this some more in the future. This was scary. This was very scary and very fun. I really want to play more of this, and I hope you guys enjoyed. I forgot what I was saying. I had to pause. But yeah, this is very scary. Um... I'll try to remember to put the mod in the description down below. It should be safe to play. It's on Cursed Forge, you know. I definitely want to play more of this, though. It was very fun. Like I said, very scary. And very, very eerie. You know, like, I love, like, the the quietness of everything when the music isn't playing. I also did like when the music was playing. It was really, like, really nice. I really want to watch videos on it, but I don't want to, like... What if there's something in this, you know, that is, like like super terrifying that i just like haven't encountered yet you know i don't want to see like spoilers to that because i wasn't i wasn't in the cave for very long also i don't know what that warden thing was i don't know if that was like a part of the mod or what but that was <laughs> that, that was annoying me I'm sorry i was all over this felt kind of like how it, when i stream stuff instead of like an actual recording because i'm usually all over the place when i'm actually like streaming so yeah i think i might maybe record more of this or just stream more i don't know yet but we'll find out anyways i'm going to actually end this one here thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you all in the next one peace out be safe and goodbye thank you guys so much for all the support consider becoming a member today it's only 99 cents and you get your name shouted out at the end of some videos like these fellas right here and also you get early access to some newer videos link will be in the description down below with more information thanks for watching